In this video, we'll walk through OpsGenie's new post-incident analysis report. The report provides a detailed overview of an incident's life cycle once it is resolved or closed. To quickly review, an incident in OpsGenie is an event that is associated with a service disruption. They are often of high priority and impact multiple teams. Because of their complexity, there are usually multiple alerts associated with an incident. Status pages are often deployed to communicate with stakeholders, and collaboration sessions can be used to facilitate efficient communication and orchestrate a response. OpsGenie's native video and audio conferencing solution is called the Incident Command Center. The post-incident report shows what occurred during an incident and provides insight into areas of success and helps identify areas that can be improved. To access the report, navigate to the Incidents page and select an individual incident that has been resolved or closed. Once you select the incident, you'll see a button to access the report. At the top of the report, you'll see important information about the incident, including its status, the overall duration, time to respond, and time to resolve. To the right of the screen, you can see if stakeholders were notified of the incident and the number of alerts associated with the incident. OpsGenie will even provide the details of each alert with a click of the mouse. The middle section provides a visual timeline of the incident's life cycle. You are able to quickly understand who and when someone acknowledged an alert or took action. You see the duration of collaboration sessions and when a particular team joined. You also gain insight into when status pages were posted and updated. More information is provided about the collaboration sessions. The report summarizes the total duration of the sessions, the number of users that joined, and team participation during each individual session. A quick click here shows an attendee list. Finally, at the bottom of the report, you can see how each team responded to the incident. Opstini summarizes who was on call for each team, their time to acknowledge, indicates the number of users notified, and how many participated in the collaboration sessions. An effective way to understand how to improve your processes is to compare two post-incident reports. The incident on the left was responded to quickly and effectively in less than an hour. The incident on the right lasted far longer. The report provides insight on how the response varied and highlights best practices. You can see that the response teams on the left were quicker to acknowledge the alerts and start collaborative sessions. Most people participated in the sessions, and the stakeholders were not only notified but kept up to date with status changes. The team on the right were slower in most actions, participated less in collaborative sessions, and did not change priorities or update the stakeholders via status pages. There are opportunities for improvement. The reports are easy to share and send to your team. You can download the visual report as a PDF or its raw data in CSV format. You can even schedule the report generation or share the report directly from within the OpsGenie interface. OpsGenie provides the post-incident analysis report as part of its enterprise product offering. If you are a standard plan user and wish to experience our incident response capabilities, please contact customer success. New users can simply start a free 14-day trial at OpsGenie.com.